Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. This is Daniel. Uh, before we do anything else, please hit that subscribe button so we can get to a thousand subscribers, the magic number. Thank you very much. And today we are back with another laser. Um, it's a cross line laser level made by this company that I have no idea how to pronounce. Uh, you can find it on Amazon. Um, I posted the link in the description below where you can find that. So let's open this up. Um, and then we'll see how it looks like and then we'll compare with the Makita that I have bought about a year and a half or maybe two years ago. So let's open this up. It comes with the, that's down, it comes with a nice pouch um, with the zipper. It's got a uh, magnetic um, stand they can uh, actually put it on metal studs it comes in this nice bag there's the laser okay we have the manual made by whatever that company it's called we have this um, whatever that is um, I believe is this uh, this is to uh, adjust your level we have another um, stand Let's put it this way we have another stand right there it also comes with batteries that these are not the original I did put new batteries in here because the original ones uh, went out but uh, this is what uh, it contains now let's turn this on let's put this aside uh, we don't need that. I'm gonna put that aside. Uh, let's uh, let's turn this on and see what what it looks like. Um, I know that um, it has cross. Uh oh, it's on. Uh, I know that it has a cross line and dots. And the reason why I bought this guy is because it's got a dot up and down, um, and that's why I liked it. Uh, it's got a lock button right here, uh, lock and unlock, unlock for uh, auto laser and lock for in case you want to use it manually in like in a different angle. Um, it has the metal, I'm um, oh, sorry, the plastic uh, stand that you can actually with the magnets you can attach it to metal studs. Uh, it has um, two uh, different um, uh, screw holes in here one is the quarter 20 and the other one is 5 8 um, the the bigger hole the 5 8 is for this support uh, that you can attach together and I'll show you what it what is that going to look like the reason one you have to use this um, this one is because um, the dot they have on the bottom, it's gonna go through this hole right here and it's gonna go up. So let me demonstrate that. You turn you um, you turn it on by flipping it to auto, uh, auto laser and then you have the line that's in the camera right now um, and then you have the dot. Now you don't have uh, options of just using the dot or just using the cross or just a line or vertical, uh, but uh, that's all right. So the whole laser, it's on or off. You don't have the option of going just a single, just a single option. I have to say that after using it for about three months now, um, it's nice. I like it, but it's not as strong as the Makita laser. You can tell this is a green line. Um, the line goes pretty good. I mean, the dot obviously goes all the way up here but the line does not go as much as the Makita goes. And, uh, and I'll show you the comparison. Now, why I wanted a dot is because there's different ways you can measure off of different walls. Uh, for example, if I have a room that's, that's this big and I can measure the bottom, set this on, on, the, on the spot that I want it, and then it's gonna show me the dot in the ceiling. Uh, so I, I like that. Now again, uh, if you want the dot on the bottom, you have to use the stand right here. It says that it's waterproof. Uh, you can actually tilt it up to four degrees until the laser cannot auto level anymore. Uh, 
Um, I like it, uh, but again, it's not as strong uh, laser. The laser light is not as strong as the Makita. Okay, guys, this is what they look like one next to each other. Uh, I have to say that Hue Power Laser uh, has the line coming from the bottom almost right here. Um, so it's really close to the laser. Makita's laser comes out about right there. Um, and then they go up. Um, now you can, you can almost see that the lasers, although one is bigger than the other, the laser line, they're almost at the same level going up. Um, and then if we follow the line, let's see, it goes up, up, and then you can tell that the green line is almost fading out. Uh, so it stops about right there. And then Makita keeps going, keeps going. Now we have the green dot from UPAR laser, but Makita keeps going, going, and going, and it fades out right there. So you can tell that Makita is way much more longer overhead. Um, now if I'm looking at the sideline, um, let's turn these guys on a side like this. See how can I make this? Um, okay, let's see. So if I'm if I'm looking on a side, um, you can tell that Makita laser is still there when the Hipar laser it kind of fades out. I can focus this. It's there, but you can barely see it. So Makita laser, it's it's much wider and much uh, it goes much more overhead. Uh, so that's the good part on the Makita. Now it is true that it costs a little more, but uh, that's how they compare. The reason why I bought this is for that dot line. I mean, um, for not dot line, for the dot that you can actually see on the bottom. Again, the laser, it's uh, Makita. It's a little bit stronger. The line, it's uh, you can see it, especially when it's bright outside. You can see much better. Makita. Hey guys, thank you so much for watching this video. Uh, this is the laser. This is what it looks like. It's a, it's a very good price for what it does. Now, if you if you like just a dot, you can actually find a, a dot laser. Uh, but I wanted to have a dot and a line because of the work that I do. So I like it. Uh, I know that uh, I'll review another laser. Uh, that has just a dot. I'll show you what it looks like and uh, uh, Stay tuned for that. Please remember to subscribe if you like this video give it a thumbs up Leave me a comment if you have any questions and we'll see you in the next one. Thank you. Bye-bye um, So that's that's it's uh, it's waterproof like I said uh, water dust and it's uh, it's pretty sturdy This is the laser. I like it. Um, I, I mean obviously it's not Today we're back. We are back with. Uh, 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 <laughs> I don't think that's the name. I know. Makita does 